Rated M for Mature. Hi, I'm Mark from Hammer 4 Publishing, here with another Dev Diary update to let you know what we're working on leading to the next update for Warhammer 40,000 Regicide. We've got quite a few new features to take you through, so hold on, this may take a couple of episodes. First up is Hot Seat Mode. Hot Seat is a two-player local multiplayer option. You and a mate on the same computer can take turns playing through the game. This is an update to the UI. You won't see enemy turn when the phase shifts, for example. Just your regular phase indicators for the active player, and you can access both players' ability sets from the single player interface. There has been demand for a tougher chess engine, and we've delivered. The improved Codex engine is capable of an ELO rated playing strength of over 2300. After the update, jump into the Veteran Master difficulty in Classic mode if you're up to the challenge. No Terran has ever managed to defeat it, including our consultant Grandmasters, so what chance do you have? We've got a whole host of new visual effects updates. Impacts now look more natural with uh, enhanced animations for sparks and blood effects. And although you asked us not to remove this bug, we have put a final end to the mutant aberration of the three-brained orc with some updates to our gib meshes. New abilities include formations, positional dependent unit enhancements such as tactical spacing, which boosts the armor of adjacent space marines until they break formation. We hope to have 16 player abilities ready for each faction in the next update, which leaves you with wider tactical options. Next time we'll be looking a little closer at the campaign, new gameplay features, possibly a new environment, so the best is yet to come.